Boy, how about those Jets today, man? A dub is a dub. We could have easily lost that game several times. I'm going to get that out of the way. But we could have easily won that game, too. We could have put that game away. I want to say easily won that game, but we could have put that game away. But those were the things that happened from a rookie's perspective. So I get it. And I, I wouldn't have been mad if we lost that game today. I wouldn't have. Because we show fight. We show competitiveness. We show the struggle to try to win. That's all we are asking for as Jets fans. To just see some light at the end of the tunnel. To see some concrete built on this foundation. That's it. So a win is a win, and that's a big plus. That's the cherry on top, man. You know what I'm saying? I got homies hitting me up right now. Like, how? Ah, what? what uh, nah. I'm just saying, man, we look like a football team today. And I got to give big ups. I got to give big ups, dog. I, I pulled up the defense today. I got to give big ups to Robert Sala and that defense today. That defense today was a real defense today. It's almost like anybody we play, they better watch out and, and, and be ready for that defense. When you look at a big uh, John Franklin Myers, he was all over him today. Pressure in a quarterback. Up and down, man. Like, you got Quentin Williams with good two sacks on him, you know? Stephon Seven is not playing with nobody, man. We even made Rex Ryan smile today. I saw, that's how good this defense was. I promise you, this defense was on top of it. You know what I'm saying? We knew, we knew big man um, Derrick Henry was going get to it, get it going on. You know, he's going to roll downhill. And it was a little worrisome at, at first. You know, it's like, damn, we knew that was going to happen. But the defense stood their ground, man. They wasn't scared. And then I got to give a big up to the secondary of the defense with Bryce Hall and them. Man, them boys was not playing. I was a little skeptical about this uh, secondary in the defense. But them boys showed up. And they played their hearts out. Big ups, man. You know what I'm saying? Brandon Eccles, I hope he ain't hurt. But he's always doing his job every week. Them, man, we got something to look forward to, man. That's all we wanted today. And to show them Jets fans that today, they didn't waste no money. Even with an L, they didn't waste no money. But we didn't get an L today. We actually copped a dub. You know what I'm saying? And this is something to build momentum with. This is something that Robert Sala said. Look, he said we're going to go through times of adversity. I'm a very impatient Jets fan. I'm sorry, I, th I think, no, nah, let me take that back. I'm a very patient Jets fan, just like all Jets fans. I think we are some of the most patient fans of the league when it comes to rebuilding and retrying and re-scrapping and redoing things. But we saw a glimpse today from a young Zach Wilson in which we finally got to see in front of the home crowd in a regular season game that he can see the defense. I mean, the man did this. He was like, most quarterbacks would have fell on the ball, like, boop, would have fell on it. And I've been like, okay, that was a great play for a quarterback just to seal the deal, not to worry about a possible turnover. You know what Zach did? He picked the ball up, looked downfield, had his feet set, and saw a young James Crowder. Down the, down the line. Boom. Hit him. That, is, this what, is this what a Zach Wilson might or can be capable of? And then zip the ball. That was the best part. The first touchdown, he zipped the ball in, in tight coverage. Couldn't been no better coverage. Zipped it to him. Boom. I said, what? This is the Zach Wilson we've been looking for. Positives, man. You know? And then the second touchdown. Looking like a young Aaron Rodgers. I, I'm sorry. I'm going to pump the brakes. But I'm, I'm hyped. I'm happy. I'm celebrating this, man. 
We got a dub today and we saw glimpses of hope. I mean, young Zach Wilson did this. <clears throat> threw it to, threw it to my man Moore. You no longer call Butterfingers Moore. I think you got the jitters off of you. You shook it off and you came up big today, my mans. Threw that bad boy to Moore. Touchdown, baby. We look really, this was old school, kind of like hard fought football. That's what it reminds me of. Because Derrick Henry did what they were supposed to do. Derrick Henry was running down a field. Look, reminded me of a, you know, Jerome Bettis. You know, the bus. I mean, hard nose running back. And he was slowly wearing that defense down. But the offense complimented the defense today in the second half, especially. And um, our boys on D didn't play. And we got, we got play from both Carters on both sides of the fence. You know, both rookies. Carter the second on the, on the defense. And, and I'm running back court, uh, boy Carter. You know what I'm saying? They, they both played ball today. Man, we showed up today. The old line showed up today. Varys Tucker. Showed up today. You know what I'm saying? I mean, these were positive things to build up on, man. And um, I'm just happy to have a positive video. And big ups to my Jets homies, man. My Jets fans, man. I mean, my Jets family. You know what I'm saying? My Jets fellow family, man, showed up and told me to be positive. It was good. And guess what? There's a glimpse of hope at the end of this tunnel. I'm happy to see it, man. Let me know what y'all think at the bottom of these comments, man. And um, let me know how you felt about what you saw today from this young Jets team scrapping today, man. That's all we could have asked for, man. It was good competitiveness and fire and um, j j just never laying down. You know what I'm saying? Big ups, man. And like I always say. J-E-T-S, Jets, 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 get it, baby. One love. I'll be in touch. I'll holler.